A warning for people flying out of Detroit tonight, and this one has nothing to do with the flights. That's our top story tonight, where we've learned the airport authorities investigating an unusual substance found in some of the bathroom soap dispensers. 7 Action News reporter Brianne Palmarini is live at the airport tonight to tell us what they're doing to fix the problem and maybe even what it is, Brianne. Well, Glenda and Dave, the airport here, you know, you go to the bathroom almost every time you go on a trip here at the airport. So it's pretty standard that you go into a restroom. And tonight, the airport authority says they're investigating after they say someone tampered with the soap dispensers inside those bathrooms, maybe a few bathrooms. And they're saying it's, quote, an unusual substance inside. Oh, my gosh. Who would do such a thing? It's scary. Yeah. That's a scary thought. DTW and the airport authority have confirmed someone found, quote, an unusual substance in a few dispensers last week in airport restrooms. But they're not saying what that substance was. They should exactly say what it is. They should let us know. So, yeah, we need to know. It's very important. Teresa Slayman works at the airport, and this news is upsetting. Well, they should be taken out and replaced, for sure. DTW and the airport authority have released a brief statement on the issue, confirming they will be taking action on the current soap dispensers. The airport authority takes incidents involving health and safety very seriously. We are in the process of installing new tamper-proof soap dispensers and are more frequently monitoring our restrooms. The airport authority is the only agency investigating the incident, not TSA, and they won't elaborate as to which soap dispensers were targeted or how long their upgrades will take. People like Slayman will be taking their own precautions. I will bring my own soap, even if they don't let me through TSA. <laughs> So something to keep in mind if you're headed to the airport. Of course, 7 Action News will keep you updated on any updates about the soap dispensers here at Detroit Metro Airport. Live tonight, Brianne Pomerini, 7 Action News.